Hello YouTube and welcome back to Korra. You may notice, you might not notice, uh, I'm using a face cam. Haven't decided if I'm actually gonna keep it in. If I do, great, you can actually see me now, hey! If I don't, uh, you can't, and deal with it. Last time, last time we were about to go under this giant wall over a lake. Not through a lake, just sort of over it. I don't know why they built it that way. It's really dark. Uh, I can kind of see me, dot dot dot, and torches are lit. Okay. Well, I'd asked before who the hell keeps lighting all these candles and torches and whatnot, and now we know, so that's pretty cool. What's up, ghost dude? Mysterious voice. So you have made it through the remnants of a time long past, and now, in the place you stand lies the border of this realm and another long forgotten hidden from those without the sight, and sealed away from those without the key. This forgotten land is a secret of the gods. However, it seems you do possess the key. What, the machete? Alas, as a key unlocks the door to the outside world, the path to the forgotten realm is now open and calls for your footsteps. Why alas? That seems like, like a kind of good thing. Did he just steal that statue? He just stole that goddamn statue. That is like... That's a crime, yo. You can't do that. Also, I like that the passage uh, between this world and this mysterious other realm is just like there's a statue. You could just walk around it, right? I mean, who would think of that? Not me, the person who just did. At least he's not making that noise though every time the ghost wanders off. It's just like, whoa, 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 whoa. Or whatever it was doing, I don't remember specifically. Don't judge me. Nice music. Very different feel from the rest of it. Much more electronic. It's pretty cool, I like it. I've already said it's nice, which implies I like it, but now I'm being explicit. Deal with it, it's how I talk. Jumping across the gaps. Um, hmm. The pacing of this game is a little interesting, because there's tons of space here, and I just sort of have to fill it. Well, I could not, but I think that kind of makes for a boring video. So there's just like this stream of consciousness going on here that, um, I don't know if it's good. And you guys don't comment. <laughs> so I guess that means no. Uh, it might also mean there aren't enough of you watching my videos to say. Tell me, please, because I love making these videos. I want to do it forever. Doing it forever would mean I need to make them really well so that you like them, so that you watch them, and I do well. And hey, telepathy. Let's see what we see. What the hell is that thing? It's asleep, thank Christ, but what? Gods, okay. Yeah, um, what, what is that symbol? Okay. Oh, uh, uh, hmm. Ah, it's like it's a nose or something. It's a giant evil snail. Ancient creature. Ellipsis. Oh my, I just like to imagine that everyone pronounces the ellipsis, just says ellipsis. That's what I do. I must have dozed off for a minute, ellipsis. That tune you just plucked out is so familiar, ellipsis. Oh right, we got that instrument before. Anyway, I apologize if I was in your way. I'm sure there's something I should be doing, like not existing. Lovely to meet you. All right, you're actually quite holy god. No, I don't like that. Okay, feeling crappy. Hmm. Ah, just makes me uncomfortable. That thing is terrifying. Okay, um, there's another one. Great. So we're just in like the land of happiness and creeping fucking monsters. And also, I guess I'm Jesus now. 
Because that looks like I'm walking on water. To me. Just kind of... Seeing what I see. I'm not sure if this is structures or like holes in the day that like I'm looking through and seeing night because it kind of looks like that too it's one thing I like about actually uh, games like this with the pixely style it, and there's the ghost at the top telling us to go up so I won't but games like this like now I can tell that it's rocks or something but uh, you can't really tell all the time, and it sort of leaves it up to, to uh, interpretation. That's the word I was looking for. And that's cool, because it's like, it could totally not be meant as holes and through the day into the night, but I'm like, that's what I'm seeing. Deal with it. Got a text. Hope you didn't hear that. And the music is still great. I want to sing to it, but I can't sing, so I won't, because that would, like, you would just die, your ears would start bleeding, and I'd lose the three followers I have, which wouldn't be too fun. I don't want that. I like you guys. I'll try to keep you alive. I hope you'll do the same for me, because that'd be nice. I hope there's an achievement for praying at every uh, statue, because I've been trying to do that. Like, I kind of just got lucky and saved time just there, but... Um, I don't know, words that I can't think of. Whoa! Spirit dragon. Or skeleton dragon. Skeleton dragon is cooler, and it's October. So that is a skeleton dragon. With no wings. It's a flying skeleton worm with a beard and horns. Explain that, you can't. That looks cool, though. I want one. Oh, more doors. Huh, <laughs> more door. Z. Or S, I guess. Traveler. Wow, who knew a place like this even existed? Not me. Not you. Not you. There is a lot of mythology based around this forgotten land, you know. I grew up hearing tales about an evil empress that tried to rule this place. I just watched her try to rule this place, which is kind of weird. We always thought it was just folklore, but now I'm having second thoughts. Whoever used to be here appears to be long dead by now, though. The font makes it a little hard to read, unfortunately. Maybe I'll finally get to see some ghosts. Like, look at those E's. That's kind of weird. I do wish there was a, a little bigger, a little more clear. That's really all I came here for, to see ghosts. I'm learning about the past and all these interesting things, but fuck it, I just want a ghost. It's October, right? That's really convenient, because I knew nothing about this game coming in. Hello, mysterious voice again. Hmm, it seems you possess the sight. For only those who can peer through the divide shall my presence be felt. You're right in front of me, man. Come on, since you've pierced the boundary of this ancient land, setting a light foot across the waters of this realm towards a strange horizon, this door shall be opened. Oh yeah, we are in, like, not Earth or Earth analog anymore. How did he get here then, that traveler dude? I want to point at things on the screen, but you can't see that, even though, like, you can see my face, my hands are also doing things. That's invisible to you, not to me. That's why I want to point at things. Let's see. Whoa, alright, droning suddenly over and suddenly back. I thought those were flowers. Alright. This place doesn't look as nice. Huh. What is that? I want to be able to read those things, but I can't. I have no idea if it's, like, even a language. It's just, like, drawing. You could be doodling, and... Wait a minute. I could go past this, and that means that I have to. Jump off the cliff. Or play music. Didn't that guy say I'd need, like, years to, uh... Master everything, and, uh, that one's also creepy. 
ellipsis. Whoa, I sure was tired. And boy does my head hurt. I'll be honest, I'm not really sure how I ended up here. And I'm definitely not staying. I also need to find some aspirin. Pretty little tune you just played, though. Reminds me of something. See ya. <laughs> it reminds me of something. Goodbye. Forever. I'll just fade out of existence now. That's how I deal with people playing music. It's like, I like that. I'm gonna never see you again. Goodbye. I feel productive that way. I don't know about you guys. Like, this, this music, right now, in this video, it's great. I'm never gonna see you again. Goodbye forever. I'll just fade out of existence now. That would be weird. I don't plan on it. Um... Hey, more temples. Like, can I not walk over there and uh, pray? Because I want to get that achievement that I don't know if it exists. Telepathy. Whoa. Ghosts. Oh, that's a graveyard in the back. That's a lot of ghosts. That is a lot of ghosts. We are on the ghost highway. Jumpy jump jump. And now we can go over here. And I'm a little curious to see whether this praying... No, I can't go back up. Never mind. I was gonna say I want to know whether the praying, like, affects that cutscene. If it's like, oh, they're calmed down now, because that would be really cool. But I can't get back. Shit ton of ghosts flying around right now. Remember, they're there. Because they're never really gone. Alright, actual growth again. That's good. Less dead. Looks less dead. It could be, like, rotten and moldy. Chop of the grass. Chop more grass. See what I'm talking about? It's really calm. I just enjoy quiet moments like this. It's been a privilege playing with you tonight. Sort of an slightly off music. Like, it's interesting, but it's like, I don't. Is that happy or sad or weird or. I don't know. Uh, like I was saying, though, quiet moments. Like right now, just sort of standing in a green hallway. I get to fill it with sort of whatever I want, and I'm not the best at that. I don't plan things to talk about which might be a mistake. So we get to learn about what goes on in my mind as I chop through some grass and I follow a ghost. That was like a green hallway and now we're in a desert. The hell is going on in this world? Like, something's wrong with the air, atmosphere, environment. That's a word, environment. That was a cool thing though. Uh, it looked sort of like an armored fox, I guess. Oh, I thought I was a noise that the animal was making. That's music. Oh, I'm just jamming out now. Get a little dance in the game, too. Oh, man. Yeah, Curve has some amazing music. Uh, th those birds are following us. We need to file a restraining order. Darn things. Pooping on everything. Chop. Chop. Chop! And chop. That is a hell of a pickaxe. And we have a hell of an arm. Huh. So, here's a thing. 
I see Mr. Ghost off to the right, which means we're supposed to go that way. I also see a rope hanging from a cliff that I can't see the top of. That makes me really curious. I want to know what's up there. I bet you do too. I think we'll find out though in the next episode because that's 15 minutes and the end of this one. I hope you enjoyed it and I'll see you guys next time on Korra and you'll be able to see me again too, which I think is pretty neat. Unless I'm bullshitting and I took the camera out because that'll just feel like an ass. But the end. I'll see you guys next time.